And we right back with another video. We right back at it. We back, we back, we back again. We back, we back again. Wow. If you know about that song, you lived in a good time. It's Turk time. last video these are the top three places I visited and again I'm gonna use places within the US because to be honest I never traveled outside of the US and uh, it's quarantine nobody's accepting us but if somebody is accepting us and again you know you're more knowledgeable than me good that's great for you. Leave it in the comments. Make me look stupid. Make me want to take this video down. But yeah, um, three places that I have visited that I can't wait to go back. Um, you can visit these places during uh, quarantine during these times. And uh, let's get it started in no specific order. Number one place I would like to visit during these times is uh, Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico was my first ever vacation uh, without my family. And uh, it was a really, really dope experience. Puerto Rico was beautiful. The people was nice. Very nice. Uh, the beaches were beautiful with crystal blue water that I don't have at home. The sand was damn near white that I don't have at home. It was it was very it was very nice. It was, it was a different perspective on things, and I swear when I went there I didn't want to come home. Uh, and I can't wait to go back to be honest. Just waiting for the right time, but I, I would love to go back. Uh, you know, every vacation, every first vacation you take, he was like, I want to move here. That was me. I wanted to move to Puerto Rico. I'm just like, damn, I want to stay here. But, you know, I kind of still do. I wouldn't mind having a uh, vacation home there. So, uh, hopefully that's something we could work on. Let's get a vacation home in uh, Puerto Rico. But, nah, Puerto Rico was very beautiful. Um, like I said, the beaches, uh, the people was, was good. The malls were ginormous and super clean or whatnot and uh the food good lord don't get me started on the food the food was a one the food was a one like from the service to the flavors to the size of the plates i didn't get not one meal where it was a bullshit portion you know the better the restaurant they they go more on decorating the plate more than giving you food Puerto Rico gives you food I think I stayed in Canado uh, it's not too far from uh, San Juan and old San Juan even though I visited those places as well uh, yeah it was it was such a good time y'all beautiful place second place I want to go back to is LA I love LA and I swear I'm gonna live there one day but LA from what I hear is kind of crazy right now with the whole COVID thing uh, man, wait a little while but damn I would love to go back you know if you go there and if you're staying there please stay safe do what's necessary wash your hands sanitizer keep your mask on when you're out in public but that's a place I would like to be uh, the heat is crazy. The palm trees, beautiful. Beautiful palm trees. Uh, the people are very nice. Um, visiting landmarks, you know, them hood landmarks like uh, Fat Burger. Y'all remember Ice Cube? Today was a good day, Fat Burger. You know, uh, Venice Beach. Very, very dope. Everything about it. You know, um, the beaches are always, always fly there. The food was tremendous. You know, 
my favorite thing there is not necessarily the restaurants but the food trucks is yo let me tell you something the food trucks there is better than the restaurants that i have at home is better than the restaurants where your home is their food trucks are so damn good let me tell you about them all right so all flavor no grease look him up on ig very 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 dope food um trap kitchen very 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 good food taco mel dope food even though he got a little restaurant now i don't know if he still do the truck but very good food and blue kitchen blue kitchen probably has the best food i've ever ate in my life it was garlic noodles and steak with shrimp on top it was the meal to remember um anytime i go back there i am visiting these trucks every single time if if i live there i don't that might be a daily meal make sure you tip them hey blue kitchen with the with the lemonade as well sells lemonade with the food and the lemonade is it's crazy it was so good i had to go right back and get another one and i left a good tip so uh you know make sure you guys leave that tip but uh yeah and i can't forget uh the first food truck i had uh, was leo's taco truck um he, he does the late night you know you you get your drink on you leave in the club leo's tacos they're gonna handle you and mind you like uh leo's tacos that his tacos is like a, a dollar each you get like four of them things that's four bills with all the type of toppings or whatever you need on it and uh it's a good time damn i'm reminiscing right now damn last but not least a place that i already visited that i would like to go back to houston houston was a good time even though your drivers are crazy these people get on a highway and punch 120 on the freaking highway they drive cars like they stole it their drinks was was bomb the drinks was always bomb their museums was very dope the galleria mall itself is a huge attraction i'm surprised it's not more popular than it is but the galleria mall look this place is huge it is huge i went there for like three days in a row i spent at least three hours there these three days like each day and i still did not see the whole mall they have a whole ice skating rink on the bottom floor of one part of the mall and i ice skated um yeah it wasn't my first time ice skating but uh it, it was a really really dope experience i never seen anything like it and the things that place have in that mall is just ridiculous like everything you need is in that mall huge huge i never seen anything like it um i don't know where it ranks amongst biggest malls but it got it's by far the biggest i've ever seen i'd love to see the mall of america but we'll save that for another time speaking of time that's my time dad what's wrong <laughs>